referees from Dominica, referees from Grenada. Permit me, before I, I give the vote of thanks and closing remarks, permit me to apologize, one, for the noise you heard a little earlier. Uh, I had to go upstairs and ask them to assist a bit on the construction. But we are building an accommodation facility upstairs because one of our major cost items in the FA is accommodation for teams in training, etc. We, we, we have a couple of grounds around here where we do for national team training. However, we ensure to the time to ensure that our national team can come in and extend the training periods and we should be able to train without the economy high cost. So that's one of the reasons why. You might, there might be small interruptions as we go in the course of the so I'm saying it before, excuse the noise that we can exist. Construction movement. Secondly, let me say that um, I'm a little disappointed. Not in you and the settings. I was supposed to have had at the back there a banner. Um, and that's the second opportunity I lost. It was supposed to have been since Saturday. A banner indicating that GFA is celebrating its 95th anniversary as a <laughs> 95 years of brotherhood. 95 years is a long time. And we're looking forward trying to build momentum for the 100th anniversary. That will be in 2024. I just want to take five minutes of the time on our team and, the, and just get away from the function and located to indicate that football. It has been demonstrated that football will be the only survivor. The only survivor. I'm making it very clear. Because sometimes I would ask folks, do you know the name of the first three, four, five, six presidents, vice presidents, general secretaries? Um, do you know the names of the executive, the first executive, the second? We know we don't know. Our documentation needs to be. We need to open our documentation and we need to be able to write our history properly. But the point is that the only survivor for this 95 years is football. We need to bear that in mind. Our role as presidents, vice presidents, executive committees, general secretaries, referees, in whatever function that you carry, our role is to ensure that we take the battle. It's like a long relay. We take the battle and we run as efficiently and effectively as we can and ensure that when we hand it, hand it over to the next set of leaders, we hand it over in a better condition in the future. And this is our fundamental responsibility. So I, want, I just want to say that um, we, we will do some more PR on the anniversary celebration, but well, I just want to bear that in mind that your function, my function, is to grow the beautiful game of football and deliver it to conditions and at a level higher than which we found. That's our fundamental. So, all this said, I just want to do what I was asking you. Um, just want to say thank you to the members of the head table, thank you to the coaches for all the sacrifices and being here. Today, some of you had to get uh, time off jobs. Uh, sorry, referees, I said coaches. Sorry, referees. Thank you to the media. It's very important that we get coverage. It's very important that we really know what's happening. Thank you to the, all of you who has any particular role to play over the next few days as we ensure that we try to raise the level of our referees, our assessors, and everyone else involved in ensuring that the beautiful game is conducted in a manner that is worthy and in a manner that we would be proud of as we go forward with football here in the and the demand that you know.